hey you guys welcome back to officially coco so today i will be showing you what's in my bag i finally bought this cutie out and decided that why not wear her um so i've been traveling with her for two days so we're gonna see what's actually in my bag <music> all right y'all welcome back to officially coco so today i'm going to show y'all what's in my bag so today i have because it's not much you can fit in this bag it's a small little convenient bag just on the go it's a crossbody like i told you or you can wear it as a shoulder bag as you can see um it has the kurt geiger bird on here um so it's nice and sturdy so you can't really mess the structure up on this bag it do not have any legs at the bottom to secure the bag when you put it down but it's hard enough i think this bag can take a lot of hits if you happen to drop it and which i did yesterday <laughs> so yes i'm going to show you what's in my bag let's get into it so what i have is my holy chick like i always carry with my medical cards and anything everything so make sure i keep all keep this handy with me all the time i'm stumbling over my words sorry and i have my change purse this is a lot of change and this is by coach as well this is by coach let me take it back this right here is rebecca minkoff and this is holy check they no longer sell this on the website if they do it may be a different um name on it it may not say holy chick it may say something else but for the most part i had that for like three three four years so i had that a long time and then a coach wallet changed first i had this for over a year um i just bought this when you all know about this my toy birch and my toy birch car um holder so i had that for a while, just a couple of months probably just a month and then i have my MCM wallet. Y'all might can see the details of it now. Because I have this ring light. So I have that in here. And that's it. <laughs> that's all you can fit in here. And it's a challenge getting this in there. So I have to start off with my change. And I can't even fit my phone in here. Which is. If I do I have to take it out the case. But I cannot fit my phone in here. And I have to turn it sideways. So this is pretty much, I probably can get it like a lip gloss or something in here. Like, let's see. And let's see if I can close it. See, you can still close it. Because they have that open room. So I can close it. So I can put a lip gloss in there, but my phone. And I'm going to, let me see my work phone. I'm going to just use my work phone as an example. Can't even put it in it because you're not going to be able to snap it. So, and being though, this is an iPhone 6. But mine's is a XR. And it's not going to fit. So, this is it. It's no back pocket. This is straight getting to it. Um, you do want to be careful because it's see-through. So, sometimes um, when I go out, I'll just make sure I pretty much put this in front of it. Or like a piece of tissue or something. Because, you know, just you got to be mindful of what you carry around and your surroundings so just be careful if you carry around a bag like this that you can actually see through it so i just wanted to show y'all what was in my bag this is a quick quick video um just to show you um again the string the strap is very very long so it stops just at the hip just at the hip it drops just at the hip and then it's on the shoulder it's much smaller when you wear it on your um shoulder but the thing about it i like the quality of it it just still structure real nice and it's not bent so that's the good thing i like about this bag so i want to thank y'all again for watching my video don't forget to like comment and definitely don't forget to subscribe and turn your notification bell on so that way you know when i upload a video and i want to thank you again for watching officially coco live life to the fullest Hi.